Hey YouTube, today we are going to make time lapse with Adobe Premiere Pro on a simple way and how you can solve a problem with that. So let's go! So, first things first, you need to make time lapse. You can make this with your phone, with the camera, I've made it with the GoPro. Then you plug in your camera, copy the photos that you want from your time lapse and put it in a uh, folder on your computer. Don't delete some pictures in the middle of your time lapse that are just not nice and uh, don't delete them because then we have a problem. But then later on the copying is done. Um, then you have three options or click the right mouse button on your sequence and push import or import at the file on your menu or push the shortcut and then select the folder where you copy your pictures in. So you are going to select the first picture and then you push numbered stilts in the left in the corner or at the windows in the middle. Premiere Pro is uh, counting down the numbers because most of the cameras give the pictures numbers in a row and Premiere Pro is just counting down and makes a video of the pictures with every picture one frame. Um, as you can see I have a very short video because there was a problem. While I was recording my time lapse, I saw the light blinking. I thought you can see it in the mirroring of the uh, window. So I stopped the time lapse and started a new one. And this was a problem I didn't expect to happen. But the number was just cut and begin a new series of time lapse. So I had to search. Uh, to the first picture of the new time lapse that took a while, so I just took a random number and I had luck. Uh, there was a very long video, and it was the whole video. Uh, if I'm correct, let's have a look. Yes, you can cut it like a normal video, and you can just speed it up like a normal video. So it's actually just normal video. Um, with pictures of frames and yes you can just put effects over it and it's just a normal video so I hope you enjoyed this video um, please subscribe for more videos um, leave a like and click here to see the end result of the time lapse and I see you next time